What's up everybody, this is Tadpole Superhero, and today, playing some Mario Kart 8. I am so sorry that I did not get the DLC Pack 2 tracks up when I said I would. I kept having audio delays, like my, my commentary was like two seconds ahead of the, uh, something. It was two seconds ahead of, what? Two seconds ahead of the game. Oh my gosh, I couldn't even figure out what I was trying to say. We're starting with 200cc, or 150, because we're going to do 200cc at a different time. Uh, so look at this. New characters? What? New carts? What? This is awesome. But anyway, I finally, I think, figured out what the what the audio delay was, which I'll, I'll find out as we go through this. But we are going to start this off with the Streetle and just go full Animal Crossing here. So I have played these tracks a few times, unfortunately. I was hoping to play them blind. For you guys, but I'm still not by any means good at them yet. So let's let's go and play them. Look at this! It's full. It's complete. It's glorious. So we have the crossing cup and the bell cup. As you can see, I've got three gold stars on the bell cup and only a bronze trophy on the crossing cup. So <laughs> let's play the crossing cup. Let's see if I can do better. Let's see if I can do awesome. Now that I'm playing for an audience, not really. Well, sort of recording. For an audience it's not the same as a live performance but you know you make do with what you got so we start off with baby park which as i've said before i've not played double dash before but this is a ton of fun and i can see why this track is so popular look at it it's like we're set in a, a nintendo theme park like nintendo version of disney world i love it I want a Nintendo theme park. It would be amazing. So anyway, we have seven, seven laps. Complete insanity. And we're all so close together, so it's actually pretty hard to keep track of your place. Uh, to know what place you're in unless you unless you look. Alright, let's keep going. And the music gets slightly faster with every single uh, every single lap. Oh, that wasn't so good. Let's let's get a let's get some shells bouncing around. This thing I like about how short how small of a track it is, is that it makes it easy to get get items bouncing around and bananas everywhere. And I do like that it's it's a narrower track. I've talked before about how I feel like the Mario Kart 8 tracks are a little too wide. Most of the time, and a lot of the times they'll take a retro track, remake it, and make the track wider. And I'm I'm not a big fan of that. You know, the tracks are the tracks are wide enough. Man, this Mario Kart is supposed to be hectic and crazy and chaotic. What lap are we on? We're on the sixth lap. Sweet. We are in first. Awesome. So anyway, I hope you guys have had a chance to play the new DLC packs. Pretty, pretty exciting. Pretty cool. It's easy to lap people in this track too, which is tons of fun. <laughs> What place did Mario come in? Let's find out. Mario came in eighth, so I lapped. <laughs> I lapped Wario, Toad, Pink Gold Peach, and Lemmy, and almost Mario. That's pretty funny. Anyway, have you had a chance to play the new DLC yet? What do you think about it? What do you think of it? It's pretty. I like it. I like the new courses. It's pretty cool. I like it a lot. Okay, so fun fact: I actually had to <laughs> had an issue, and I had to go back and re. Uh, I had to stop my, my recording stop so I had to go back uh, the baby park is still intact so what you just saw I didn't have to re-record that but I did re-record it or I did redo it so that I can get first place and now here I am same setup on cheese land from Mario Kart Super Circuit so here we are <laughs> I'm having so many problems lately I don't know why with recording I have no idea why but anyway this course is deceptively tricky um, it's kind of like Bone Dry Dunes, which if you played that course, it is, it's a very tricky track, especially at first, the turns are really, really kind of nasty, man. It's just got some really nasty turns, and it's deceptive, because it doesn't look that challenging, but it is, <laughs> it's a, it's a tough one. Uh, Cheese, Cheese Land is a lot like that, too. Uh, the first time I did this track... I was all over the place. I was like falling off the course left, right, and center. It's a mess. But here we are. 
Unfortunately, I've had practice, so you guys don't get to see me fail spectacularly. Like we've seen, like we saw, I've only gotten a bronze medal on this uh, on this cup. Oh, come on! And that's largely because of Cheese Land. <laughs> uh, the first, actually, the first time I went through this through this cup, I actually came in like fifth place overall. I didn't even get I didn't even get a cup. I didn't even get a trophy. I was that that pathetic. So, yeah. Luckily, I have improved measurably since then. Oh, no, no, no. I didn't get a big enough boost. All right, here we go. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, no. Oh, no, I've ruined everything. Wow. Okay, those shortcuts are a little trickier than they look. How am I in first place? It must be really great shortcuts, though, I guess. They are trickier than I thought they were. You gotta, you gotta get a boost at the right, the right time to get both of them. Oh, but those are nice paths to take if you have, if you have mushrooms, go for it. Nice that I hit that boost pad, so I didn't get inked. Nice thing about boosts, they, they keep you free of inkage. I think I just invented a word, inkage. That's cool. How are you guys enjoying the uh, the new DLC tracks? I'm having tons of fun with them. I really do enjoy them. Uh, the first pack of DLC I actually had, I think two, I think two of the tracks I'm kind of, eh, not not really that hyped about. This pack, I think I really do enjoy every single track in this pack of DLC, which is which is pretty sweet, pretty sweet, and. 200 CC is fantastic. It wasn't part of the DLC. That's actually a free update, but it dropped at the same time as the DLC. So, dude, 200 CC is nuts. We're gonna do quite a few videos with that as well. Wild Woods. This is a brand new track made for the DLC, and it is glorious. I love it. It's so much fun. A beautiful track. We go through a shy guy village inside a, a forest, inside some wild woods. We got some wild woods going on. Oh, uh, yeah. Okay, let's let's go this way. Uh, okay. In case you didn't notice, you actually start. Uh, <laughs> ow. <laughs> you actually start this course going up a tree in anti gravity mode. Hello, Dry Bowser. Look at that! Look at that village. Visually, this this course is just is stunning. It's so lovely, and I love it. It's lovely and I love it. How's that for a obvious statement? There's a nice shortcut there if you've got a mushroom or a star. You usually don't get those in first place though. <laughs> oh, I don't know if I mentioned it, but this cart that we're in, the, one of the new ones for the DLC, is called the Streetel. And it's a, uh, it's, it's shaped kind of like a beetle. It's got, it's like a stag beetle because it's got that set of horns on the front and if you notice the back is kind of like the shell of a beetle with the wings they'll open up when you when you get a boost or when you fly or things like that I'd rather not get inked mr. squid blooper person and this is actually at the bottom of the tree you'll see it's a toad village so we got a shy guy village above and toads toads below it tells you there's a, there's a bit of a a class hierarchy, division of classes. The toads are oppressed by the shy guys. Oh, that was probably a bad banana placement. So how are you guys, I've already asked how you're enjoying the new tracks. Well, how are you enjoying them? Let me ask you again, because asking twice is always good. <laughs> This, this track's music is really just kind of nice. It's nothing to write home about, but it's it's pretty cool. I like it. The visuals are really the the key here, and the track is just it's just fun. Listen to the uh, the oh look w when you get in first place with Villager or Isabel, uh, their victory animation is actually slightly different. They have flowers. Look at that, so cute. And listen to the the sound of the horn. I think that's that's like a sound. All of the sounds for the villager are sounds from Animal Crossing that you actually make in uh, in New Leaf. 
which is super cute. So uh, the villager actually does not have a voice, just has little uh, sounds and such. It's cute. I like it. All right, here we are. Animal Crossing. We are in fall. This track changes the season randomly each time you play. I have played in spring and summer. Or I've not played in fall or winter, so this is cool. And aside from visuals, there are slight changes. Uh, the track layout is the same, but there are slight changes. Like in summer, there are, there are ramps that aren't that you can get boosts off of that aren't there in the other seasons. In in winter, there are snowmen that roll around and you serve as obstacles. In fall, as you probably saw, there are piles of leaves, which I'm actually not sure what are in the piles of leaves. Probably mushrooms. I haven't managed to go through one yet, so... Yeah, there are ramps along here in the summer. Um... Yeah, there's just cool stuff. Cool stuff happens in the Animal Crossing track. And there's Rissetti. And behind us, or ahead of us, or somewhere, is the, uh, the museum. We passed the museum. Oh, the little... Ow. I think the leaf piles actually serve as speed boosts. Let's find out. Let's, let's go through one. Let's make sure we go through one. Oh no, they're just they're just there. They just do things. Why am I going the long way when I have mushrooms? What am I doing? I mean, we head through the village, which is just so cute. There are lots of Animal Crossing villagers you can see around there. Go along the beach. I think this is styled after after the New Leaf version. The village and New Leaf. Oh, I missed that jump again. Come on, baby Luigi. Baby Luigi! Take that. Haha. -ha. No! Oh, and the uh, the coins. Look at the coin counter in the bottom uh, bottom bottom left. It's actually the the bell bag you have in, in Animal Crossing. And then the coins are actually bells, which are the coins from, from Animal Crossing. Which is super cute. It's just super cute. Why am I in fifth place? What am I doing? What have I done wrong? What did I do to deserve this? I missed. You can get a trick off the end of that bridge, and I've missed it every single time. Dry Bowser is leading, leading the charge. All right, second place. Did I get first in every single other track? I think so. That was cool. So that actually ends. We're gonna do one pack a day, just because shorter videos. <laughs> with my internet <laughs> shorter videos upload much easier on YouTube uh, so I like to keep the videos shorter so we're gonna stick to that for this one that was the crossing cup next week will or not next week it will probably be a day after this one will be the bell cup thanks for watching guys let me know what you think what is your favorite track out of the new DLC pack how are you liking 200 CC we're gonna get into that in the future and leave me a comment let me know what you think thanks for watching and I will see you guys next time. Look at that beautiful golden trophy. Awesome. Just awesome.